Welcome to the position of here. So we're going to do some final drills for energy to please the gods. But I just want to reiterate something from those drills. I could throw you some. It's okay, you're just a meat puppet for now. Nothing yeah. is required of you but pain. <laughs> so it's all about smart animals evolve. You too must evolve your position. This is worth one point. Yeah? This is worth five points. Yeah? If I can get him here, that might be worth nine points. You know, where I can get him and hold him and beat him, the better the position, you must work to get better and better positions where he is more and more helpless and you are more and more powerful. Does that make sense? Yes, sir. So there's no point in me just staying here. If I can evolve that to that, take it. Yeah? Put him in the most vulnerable spot and beat him until he stops moving. So always try and evolve. I, you know, trade, trade wisely. You know, crappy Nissan Micra for a Volvo. Volvo for a Ferrari. Ferrari for a Harrier jump jet. You know, like, <laughs> always be trading up. Don't down trade yourself. So even if I started with just this little finger, I can use that to your right little finger and a thumb. Little finger and a thumb and an elbow. For an elbow, I've got a face. You know, trade up, keep trading up whilst you really beat the shite out of him, okay? So that's a simple drill. You need to be ready for that human airbag to go off at any time. If you've got a decent shot, sometimes they go flat. Sometimes they go, ha, pitiful, bang, and they knock you out. Sometimes they grip you up, and sometimes the airbag goes off. You need to be ready for all those variables. A hit a man, drops. Hit a man, wobbles an airbag. Hit a man, and he hits me back. I must always be ready for a different variable to come back. I need the mental elasticity to respond to any of those variables. Because humans are weird and different and respond in weird and different ways. But soon as I've got that human airbag, he's on the back foot. And whether it's war or fighting, as soon as you've got momentum, keep momentum. If it's my time, it's my time, it's Tommy o'clock all day. Boom, ah, it's Tommy o'clock, it's Tommy o'clock. My time, make sense? So own that time, own that space. The final drill will be an amendment on my usual wall of death, which some of you might have seen. And it's gonna work like this, I'll borrow Luke, because he knows the drill. So it's retired. Okay, put those on. So we're gonna start the drill on one whistle. Boom. And I'm gonna, sh we're gonna start having a row. You fucking, you fuck you. you. We're really gonna have a loud verbal fight. Yeah? One whistle, we're gonna really give it each other verbally. When I blow my whistle again, he's gonna come at me swinging these big old shots. That makes sense? So on the second whistle, he's just gonna wade in, slapping me with these pads. Your job, survive it, get a grip of opportunity, and use it. Don't give him the opportunity to slap you back with that pad. You know, here, he can slap me back a bit, can't he? So I'm gonna trade that in for a better model. Oh God, that was a really good model. <laughs> <laughs> Does this make sense? So when the first whistle, blah, 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 second whistle, he's gonna really wade in. And I want you to be a T-Rex. Don't be like, don't start, start, hitting, him. start hitting me. Don't be all, don't be trying to come through him. Just eat him. As soon as he starts hitting, I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna be heavy on that. I'll trade that for a bit of belt. Bang, bang. I'm gonna trade that for a bit of face. Da, and trade up. Does that make sense? <laughs> really give it to each other verbally. And Padman, do the person the decent ong of really trying to wail on them a bit. Make sense? Yeah. Give them verbals as well. So when he's whacking me, I'm not even gonna defend myself. Make some noise. Well, uh, noise, what's that? Come on, okay. some noise. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> ah, ah, ah. That, all right? Energy, on. Oh, this is what I want to say. When I'm smashing him up, how are you doing today? No. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. I want him terrified. And I want him waiting in the bush terrified. I want everyone terrified this big fat ginger nut is going to eat my eyeballs. Yeah. <laughs> really put the fear of God into him. Make sense? Yes, you get yes. two lines facing each other here with a partner. Guys, do one line quickly. I take a picture because we're going to have to talk. <laughs>